I was riding uh, my son, who is now 52. I was riding uh, my bicycle with him in a basket in front of the handlebar, in the handlebars, and I saw all these people come out of their houses, you know, in, in bewilderment and started talking about what was happening, and I immediately went uh, in the house and the little black and white TV, which we all had then, and uh, that was in the off season for baseball, obviously, but I, I think it's just one of those... Uh, uh, yeah, people have used the expression America lost its innocence. Uh, j I just think it's something that we never dreamed would happen. We'd heard about Lincoln, but we never dreamed it would happen uh, uh, in our lifetime. And uh, it, it certainly changed, uh, changed the United States. But certainly I'll never forget where I was on that day. Remember it as though it were yesterday I was at my home. My home is Sumter, South Carolina. And I remember walking through the living room. And um, it was told to me at that time that our president had been, been killed. And I can remember it though it were yesterday. Fifty years later, it's, uh, it's sort of like 9-11. We'll remember that for as long time as well. But, uh, and then to follow it with Bobby Kennedy as well, uh, certainly we won't forget that. He was a great president and a wonderful man.